What is up everybody? Welcome back to Pinoy Balance and in this last portion segment, we get to look at into Stay Mellow, Jermaine's collection and showcase. So he showed me one of his showcase. So talk to me about this showcase. We call it the LeBron James. So this is the cream of the crop in, in any sort of um, NBA collectibles in Top Shot specifically. Talk to me about this collection of LeBron James. Well, that's uh, my LeBron James collection, AKA my retirement plan. I love that. <laughs> and that's just, that's just what we got here. I'm so, happy I got to finish it. Yeah. Talk to me through about each collect. Okay, we can start through the first one. So this is on, on an amazing uh, moment. LeBron's Top Shot debut. Talk to me about this. How did you, uh, did something you pulled from a pack? Did you bought this off secondary? What was your... It was definitely something I pulled in a pack. Oh, that's that, amazing. That might be my second greatest day. <laughs> but I was really excited when I pulled that too. Yeah. Wow. Um, a little fun fact: I only bought uh, only two of the rares, so wow. it would be the MGLE two and his uh, All Star moment. All Star moment, right? Everything the else was pulled was, from a pack, right? I was grateful enough to pull from a pack. Yeah. And the crazy part about it, you go into there's only 14 people willing to sell it out of 299, and. <laughs> The lowest price is what thirty two thousand. So depending on the serial, and you have a pretty low serial too. That's an insane. I mean, I think the craziest part about it is, I mean, it was like a twenty four dollar pack, right? Yeah. <laughs> and yeah. it's going for like thirty five k. So. Exactly. <laughs> that's I think an that's amazing crazy. moment. <laughs> Let's look through the second one. All right, we got LeBron James first round. Talk to me through this one. This was uh, a nice moment too. I really liked this moment. I was so happy when I pulled this because I really wanted that. Jeez. Nice little backdoor cut. From 82. Eh? Oh man, that's a nice one. I'm um, a real fan of uh, the bubble plays actually too. I, me too. I think it's going to have so much value once things kind of go back to normal. It's so unique, you know? <laughs> 100%. Yeah. It's oh, like a timestamp, right? Yeah, it is a timestamp. I, I agree, man. Oh man, this LeBron dunk. Oh, legendary too. Well, only 79. Jeez. Man, the way I jumped up out of my chair, buddy. <laughs> when you got this one? <laughs> man, I don't even want to check. There's only five people selling it. I don't even want to check how much it is, but I'm just going to click it. <laughs> Did you see uh, his jersey sold today? Jeez, his jersey sold today for... 230K, I believe, maybe? Jesus Christ. Yeah. My God. Crazy. My God. All right, talk to me about the next uh, moment here, which is an, an amazing moment to have in the Top Shot collection. The LeBron James legendary moment. How did you came upon this one? Like, what was it like to grab this moment off of your, uh, out of a pack, right? <laughs> uh, finals legendary? Yeah. Yeah, uh, like I uh, told people before, like this might've been like the greatest day of my Top Shot life, man. <laughs> so uh, basically how the story goes was I didn't, I wasn't able to land a pack. And back in the day, if you refreshed the page, sometimes if um, sales didn't go through, they would restock on the page. Ah. So I was uh, refreshing for about five or 10 minutes until finally I was able to snag one because they're getting stream sniped, you know, they're getting sniped. Yeah. Yeah. And um, luckily I was able to snag one and LeBron was inside, man. It was, it was amazing. This is an amazing moment, man. Like it's, it's the one you hold for a very long time. <laughs> yeah, man. <laughs> uh, I love these retirement. I, I love the retirement showcase. <laughs> uh, let's go through. Let's go to this one. The throwdown moment. The Kobe tribute dunk, right? Yeah. The Kobe tribute. Yeah, everybody loves this moment. Jeez. Oh, I love this anime. Uh, this part of. Oh my that god! Angle. Look at that. Yeah. It's a beauty. Yeah. Jeez. All right. Oh, okay. Man, most of LeBron's moments have been uh, really nice dunks, but a lot of them are dunks. <laughs> Let's talk about this one. Oh, another bubble moment. Yeah. Jeez. Get out the way, buddy. Jeez. Is that on Brody? I remember that, actually. Oh, my God. Yeah, it's on Westbrook, right? <laughs> yeah. That's a like beauty. it's crazy to go back and think about these moments being worth like 60, 70 bucks on Marketplace. Like it's... Yeah. Like how? <laughs> it's insane, man. Like it's honestly crazy. Like to think about it. <laughs> yeah. 
Because I was thinking to myself, like, if I heard about this, like, or if I discovered this, I would have been like, I wouldn't even hesitate. Like my, like my take was, I, I guess it was just my understanding of how crypto works, and right. and, and and being a basketball fan and, and understanding collectibles. I wasn't a big fan of collecting physical because I was, I didn't want to hoard, you know. I didn't want to have my room full of like physical ass like cards just like yeah. taking up space, and then you got to take care of it. And you gotta yep. like protect yep. it, and then you you know you could damage it by just simply like folding it, right? I just wasn't. It's kind a of a good of... thing I found Top Shot too because I was just starting to get into the the cards. Okay. Oh. When I found Top Shot, I was like, yeah. all right, this is so much better. Yeah. You don't gotta send it for like six months and wait to get it back because grading and stuff and. Yeah. No, yeah. this is amazing. No, like honestly, man. Learn my lesson. I have Twitter now. That's the <laughs> that's the best uh, lesson you could ever learn is Twitter. <laughs> right. Like, can we talk about this one, the uh, a dunk finals moment, right? Yeah. Um, what I remember about this moment, or what I should say about this pack, is that people were stacking this like crazy. Really. Like, people were stacking rare packs like nothing, man. Really? Is it because there was not enough demand? Like not enough like. People bought, like, it was just not enough user yet, like, but with a lot of packs available? No, it was LeBron, to be honest. Yeah. Everybody wanted to land this LeBron. Oh. Like, the finals, because, you know, it was the first, it's the bubble, and... Yeah. It turns out to be the championship, you know? Jeez, yeah, the badge, man, that's just... So everybody was kind of banking on making some money off Bron, so... Yeah. <laughs> people went crazy on packs. This is awesome, yeah. Oh, this was nice. So this is quite recent still. So um, uh, talk to me about this, doing this challenge yeah. or buying it off the secondary. Yeah, I bought this uh, off. No, no. To be honest, um, I traded. I traded oh, somebody. Traded. Yeah. Oh, I see. Yeah. So this and um, his finals or uh, his all-star, sorry, is the only two I never got yeah. from a pack. Uh, this is a great moment, man. I remember watching this game as well. <laughs> I was kind of mad they won. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm a, I'm a big Warriors fan, so when I, I taught him pull that off of yeah. Steph, I was just kind of... I wanted G-State to make it. Yeah, <laughs> me too, man. Uh, I wanted that comeback story to show, because I wanted Curry to have another MVP. Uh -huh. So I thought if he make it, and then they make it deep into the, uh, the run, they could right. have a chance again, right? So, and then he could get maybe another MVP, right? <laughs> Exactly. Uh, talk me through this one, this second to last one. I love this hoop. I love yes. that alley, man. Oh, that's a beauty animation. Oh my God, look at the edit. Um, I think this was, if I'm not mistaken, um, when this came out, we we're talking about trying to be uh, like featured on like a, uh, you know, like the. Uh, what do you call it again? For the fans, like the online oh, fans. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I see yeah. So yeah. like people are trying to see if like if you could get like caught in something, like you know, like so you yeah. know I could be in a moment type, you know. Yeah, like kind of like yeah. what happened with the Top Shot Fund with the. Um, with yeah, his, uh... exactly. Exactly. <laughs> that's dope. Yeah, yeah that's dope. <laughs> yeah. Jeez, that's a beauty. All right, our last one in this um, collection is I, I love. I have this one too, so I bought it yeah. off secondary too. I think this is still underpriced if you ask me. I think so too. I, my take on this is it's the first All-Star bubble. Exactly. And um, it's the first all, last all LeBron's All-Star wearing 23. So there's so much narrative in this. That's in a this, good one. Um, yeah, this is I a lot of narrative in this. I have to pick up an extra this. now. <laughs> yeah. Because <laughs> uh, my take was I was at a point where I was looking at like, I think there was a lot of the point at all the times where the price was already baked in into Series 1 moments. But I felt like there was still a lot of um, discounts on Series 2 because not a lot of people were able to get multiple packs on it. So exactly. I felt like there was, you know, there was a lot of some deals that you can get on. So my, my mind was looking into the All-Star set. Talk to me about one. I know you've collected basically like such some of the Holy Grail moments in Top Shot. But is there one that you don't have yet that either was you're trying to get or would be your Holy Grail if you ever got one? Um, We all know LeBron's the best of the best and we all would love to hold a LeBron yeah. but my holy grail right now which I just completed uh, last week I got yeah. the number 62 uh, Carmelo rib moment 
And oh, for no those way. who don't know, that was the game where he scored a he franchise scored six, high, yeah. 62 points. He's running and, back, right? Yeah. So oh, I think this is getting such a, a serial number 62, that, that, was, that, was, that was huge for me. Jeez. This, I, I, I think that Melo was at his best when he was in New York because I think it just felt like him, you know? Like he was the kind of, yeah. I think he embodied what New York basketball was. You know, yeah. that uh, like gritty, uh, hard work, you know, for- 100%, it, it, he put the city <laughs> on his back, man. Yeah, like this is a beautiful moment, man. It's I, I think it's one of the signature moments in the in the run it back set or even in Top Shot specifically too, right? 100%. And, Congrats on that, man. That's a great moment. Thank you. And appreciating it before we end this. There you go. <laughs> well, we're out of time, Jermaine, but I, hey. That's fine. That's this, cool. This was a great, I mean, uh, one of my favorite uh, episodes now with Top Shot. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> before we before we end it out, Jermaine, any sort of last words, any shout outs you want to give out to maybe, you know, friends, family, loved ones? Yeah. Uh. I want to shout out Roham. I want to shout out Dapper. I want to shout out Top Shot. I want to shout out all the OGs. You guys know who you guys are. The originals, you know. Shout out everybody. Shout out all the newcomers. Shout out all the females. Continue doing your thing. We'd love to hear about more of you guys. And keep collecting. Happy collecting. I love that, man. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. And keep collecting. Tech 2 Top Shot. Look around and see if it's something. If you guys have any questions, Twitter, Discord has been the best help for uh, for us early collectors, and early OGs when they started. So I hope you guys can can look through it and start collecting yourself and some of your favorite moments. And other than that, guys, stay balling. Yeah.